This segment brought to you by Kansas Corn. Learn more at kscorn.com. Welcome back. Now let's see what Kyle and Dwayne are up to today on Plain Talk. Hi, this is Kyle Bauer with Plain Talk with Dwayne Taves. Kyle Bauer, your factor. Wait, wait, wait. You, you promised mean? me I could do oh. the factor fiction. All right. All right. We're going to let it slide Dwayne Taves, one time. Fact or fiction? Yes. 10% of the electricity in Kansas is produced by wind. 10%, exactly 10%? Uh-huh. Well, at least probably 10%. varies on how hard the wind's blowing that day. No, it really doesn't. No, it doesn't. Okay. No, there's some... There's a lot more technicality to producing wind. True or false? Fact or fiction? It's fact. We get 10%. Yeah, I mean, I'll go with You know, true. I kind of, I kind of, I see, I'm not used to doing this. You got to learn how to 19, lie better. I knew. It's 19%. Well, but see, if it's 10%, 19, then it's 10. Yeah, I get a win. Yeah. According win to this, for Dwayne. All right. 19% of our electricity in Kansas comes from wind energy. Really? Now, some of it gets exported. Sure. But our total capacity that we get, we yeah. use. You know, that's got to have come on big i mean 10 years ago i bet it wasn't two percent uh, not in kansas probably exactly that's yeah. what i mean now there's the next question for you though Dwayne taze yes. which one has more wind energy production oklahoma or kansas oklahoma not by a lot though right. just it's pretty close to the same they're building which has them down more, there too iowa or kansas Oh, Kansas. No, Iowa almost really? twice as much. The Iowenies. Yeah, exactly. And actually, Minnesota has as much as Kansas does, very similar amounts. Huh. Yeah, I would have never understood why that. that was. Yeah, me too. I didn't really think of Iowa as being a windy place. Well, and it's, but you don't it's need, got enough hills. You don't need a lot of wind. You need, you need a steady, steady wind. wind. Right, and yeah. they have enough hills that you get up on a hill and you get it another 300 feet in the air. Right. You know, I've been up on some of our radio towers, and it's amazing. Sometimes on the ground, there is no wind, and you get up even 100 feet. And, and there's, there's a nice, moving. steady breeze, yeah. yeah. Very seldom. Well, that's how that, that whole deal with airplanes happens that way. They get up in the air. Okay. And you get a pretty good tailwind. You can make up time in a hurry. Okay, I had no idea where you were going on that, because yeah. it's like airplanes don't go by just the wind, you know. No, they no. they got those engines Yeah, on they wing. get up in the air, and then the wind just takes yeah. it. It's, yeah, it's, no. Don't even put a sail out. Yeah, that was Dwayne Taves, not Kyle Bauer. Yeah. Do not call me. <laughs> so what state in the nation generates the most wind power texas exactly by far and away uh four times as much as kansas four well, they're times. four times as big as we are well yeah population they're even well, more than that yeah but it's land mass well I mean, okay if it's a land it. mass thing then california how much do they yeah they get a lot more solar in california okay so do they produce more or less than than less kansas? Than kansas right they produce more yeah by twice Twice as much. Well, if it's just a landmass thing, how about Arizona? I mean, they got a lot of landmass there. Yeah, there's not much wind in Arizona. Well, you're right. No, it's there's hardly anything generated there. So, yeah. I bet if you had solar numbers for Arizona, I would, don't. That might surprise. Now, I, this by I've been read the, somewhere that solar is the fastest growing of the renewables. I think there's a lot of if people a, believe that that technology is just on the edge of being affordable for a lot of people. Thanks for joining us. I'm your host, Jamie Bloom, and I hope you enjoyed today's show. See you next week on Farm Factor. We're here every Tuesday on Ag AM in Kansas. Closed captioning brought to you by Ag Promo Source. Together we grow. Learn more at agpromosource.com.